Good morning to everyone. Myself, V. Mageshwari, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Application, KSR College of Arts and Science for Women. Now we can see Web Technologies Unit 3, 4 and 5. First one is in Web Architecture. It is a basic diagram of Web Architecture. It contains cryptography, uh, OL, S, uh, SPRIL uh, and RDBMS, RDF and XML. This is the basic uh, architecture of an uh, www. Next one, first protocol is an FTP. FTP is a file transfer protocol. It is a basic protocol for uh, communication. It is a standard internet protocol provided by TCP IP used for transmitting the files from one host to another. It is mainly used for transferring the web files from the creator to the computer that acts as a server for the other computers on the internet. It also used for downloading the files from the other servers. Next one, um, mechanism for FTP. How uh, 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 FTP protocol uh, works? The user uh, interface the control process. It control process to the TCP IP. Uh, then the data transfer to the server. Uh, the client uh, requests to the server, the server uh, responds to the client. Next one, the above figure shows the basic model of TPP. The, uh, that means the above uh, diagram is the basics of FTP. The FTP contains uh, two types of transfer, connection control and data connection. Uh, the first one is control connection. It uses very simple rules for communication. Through this connection, we can transfer a line for a command or response time. It control connection is made between the control process. It remains connected during the entire interactive FT FTP session. Next one, data session. It is uh, very useful uh, complex rules as a uh, data types uh, may vary. The data connection is made between data transfer process. It opens when a command comes comes for transferring the files and closes when the file is transferred. Uh, next protocol is HTTP. It is an hypertext transfer protocol. It is used for WW uh, World Wide Web. It is used for transfer the data in the form of one plain text, hypertext, audio, video and so on. This protocol is known as hypertext transfer protocol because of its efficiently that allows us to hyper text environment where there are rap rapid jumps from one document to another document. Uh, this is the basic function of uh, HTTP. Next one, the basic architecture of web, uh, HTTP, it contains web server, web client and database and the server side script. Next one, uh, URL, uniform resource uh, locator. A client that wants to access the document and internet needs an address to facilitate the address of document. It's the concept of uh, URL. URL is a standard way of specifying the kind of information on the internet. It defines the part, parts, four parts, method, host, computer, part and path. Next, HTTP messages. It contains server and client. Mm, HTTP message used to show how data exchanged between client and server. It enables a program to establish connection to the server to send one or more HTTP records. It consists of initial requests line and the initial response line. Next one, generation of dynamic web pages. Web pages is a collection of websites. It contains uh, to store the web server and can use the web browser. A collection of linked web pages on a web server is known as website. There is a unique in uniform resource associated in each web page. This is the basic uh, diagram of web page, the web browser. That means client uh, send the request to the web, ser inter uh, web server. The re uh, server responds to the client. These are all the uh, protocols are used in uh, web technologies. Thank you.